In this video, this QCX Mini is transmitting a, a whisper, weak, weak station propagation reporter signal. Um, and uh, the next transmission will take place at 2322. The 22 on the screen is when the next transmission will take place, and that's in about uh, three, four minutes. It's transmitting at 5.288 megahertz, and uh, the real real time clock is indicating the current time in universal coordinated time. Here we are. We are less than 30 seconds away from transmitting again at 23:22. After transmission, we'll go through the setup menu. Uh, so that I can show you how to set up uh, a QCX Mini to transmit as a whisper beacon. And here we are, transmitting. It's transmitting the call sign NY4G. It's also transmitting the grid square EM85. And it's also transmitting at 33 dBm. 33 dBm corresponds to 2 watts. If it was transmitting at uh, 5 watts, it would be 37 dBm. If it was transmitting at uh, 200 milliwatts, it would be transmitting at 23 dBm. And these are settings that you can set in the setup menu. So the elapsed time for the transmission is now going on 74 seconds. And we'll wait a few more seconds until it finishes transmission. This is a key down mode, so it's transmitting a full key down 2 watts. So it transmitted for about 150 seconds, it looks like. So the time on the real time clock now is 23.24. It's now 23.24. And the next transmission time is in eight minutes. That gives us plenty of time to go through the setup menu. So we'll go through the menu. And we go through beacon, which is menu number six. The mode is whisper. This can be toggled to whisper. To FSK, it can be turned off. It can also send the CW beacon mode, but we'll keep it at whisper. And the frequency we've set is this frequency, and there are just a few defaults that are dedicated to whisper protocol. And uh, we're transmitting every 10 minutes. And this is considered normal. If you transmit, let's say, every two minutes or every four minutes, that's considered uh, antisocial behavior because it leads to a lot of crowding in, in the whisper bands. And um, instead of starting at zero on the time clock, we will set it to start at two minutes after um, after the, the, the start of the clock, so two minutes after the hour. And so it'll be two minutes after every 10 minutes. And the whisper call is NY4G. And this is the tricky part. 
um, you have to be able to put um, spaces in uh, to make, because if you don't put the right, because it has space for six characters, if you put the wrong characters in the, in the placeholders that, like if you have a, uh, a four uh, character call sign, you need to be able to put the right spaces in and otherwise it, it will not it will not take the call sign and you can toggle between fields and those are the correct space designation and the whisper locators em85 from iqth the whisper power is 33 dbm and you can, there are only certain numbers you can, it will accept. Um, and set time is that's 2327, which is the current time mode. And we come out of this one and we save settings. And we're still on track to, sorry, we're still on track to transmit uh, on uh, 2322. Well, I hope that was helpful in getting you set up to transmit Whisper on your QCX Mini. And we'll see you in the next video.